Begins, you never quite know who's going to be there at the end. Now only two teams left in the cup, and we're left wondering who's going to be lifting it. We'll have every kick of the ball for you live on EA TV. Well, after plenty of pre-match anticipation, the wait is finally over. My name is Derek Ray. I'm joined by Lee Dixon in the commentary box, and we're just seconds away from kickoff in what promises to be a spectacular final. It is St. Gallen up against Luzern. Got goosebumps just thinking about kickoff time. You've got to control your nerves. Playing in a game like this, it's all about the nerves. Nerves can be your friend, but they can also destroy you. Keep them under control. This is how the starting lineup looks today. What do you think about this particular setup? Well, strikers like support, and they've got support today in the number 10. They've also got three midfield players behind, two slightly wide, and one just sitting in front of the back four. This is what they'll be up against today. Well, as a team, they do have their stylistic preference, and it really is all about trying to put the opposition under pressure, making sure that they don't compose themselves. Lee, do you expect to see more of that in this game? Yeah, pretty much. They love to press high, don't they? It's their preferred style of play, winning the ball high up the pitch. It certainly benefits their strikers. They're very good at it. They've lost it. Schwegler. Deserves credit for winning the ball back. Could play it in. And space for him to cut in. Must take the lead here. And thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. Schwegler. Sorgic. Patient build up at the moment. Well cleared away. Schaub. Can he find the net? A routine save. What can he do from here? Pressure exerted, but he keeps the ball. How about the cross? That's how to rob them of possession. An attack full of promise. Terrific block there. Schaub. It might be. And a goal! The first of the contest. Well, it's always best to get your nose in front in the final. Really puts the pressure on the opposition. Well, it's good play. Ian Wright always told me, stand in the middle of the goal. It sounds simple, but you don't have to get a lot of goals from that position. Slightly different vantage point in terms of the goal that was scored.
So the match has restarted. 1 0 here. Well, can they open up the defence here? Good work to regain possession. Schaub. Sorgic. And Schaub on the ball. Sorgic. And he keeps going. It looks promising. Friedek. And putting his body on the line. In behind for him to chase. Flinging himself at it, the keeper. And now the delivery. Well, body in the way. Smuggled away. Space and time for the cross. But dealt with efficiently. Bodies forward and the break looks on. End product or not. That's a useful cross. Well, not cleared away completely. And so it is, the first half story has been written. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Schaub. Knezhevich. Schwegler. Did well to win the ball back. Counter attacking very much an option. Defenders need to cover. And the flag does go up offside. And time for the change now. Oh, nice ball. Had a chance to whip it in here. They've given it away. And we're inside the final 30 minutes. Ibrahima Ndiaye.
Knezhevich. Schaub. You can sense the threat is there. What can he do from here? A super tackle and they've won possession. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Friedek. So, 20 minutes to go. The outcome is a goal kick here. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. And he did well to cut it out. Well, you've got to conclude that it was completely overhit. And able to close down the shorts. Could be a chance to break here. Do they have the guile to open up the defence? Well, the attack lacks a little bit of oomph. They are making headway, but really they need a goal with time not on their side. Dangerous looking attack. Well, he's thwarted him almost effortlessly. Knezhevic. Promising pass. Well, attacking possibilities. Schaub. Can he finish them off? And able to get a body in the way. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. All hands on deck. This could be the equaliser. Oh, off the post. Still alive. But it can't get all the way through. Ndiaye. And the final whistle. The cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. And Lee, memories are being made. Yeah, absolutely. It doesn't matter how much money you've got in the bank. Players will always look back at moments like these. These moments where you pick trophies up, win medals, absolutely brilliant for this group of players. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. Well, it's these moments, Derek, when you get your hands on the silverware, and that little medal that goes round your neck, might seem small now, but you'll look back at that. Show your grandkids absolutely superb memories these players will have of this game. It's a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The cup winners! Yeah, it's been a long old road to get to this point. They're going to celebrate now and certainly celebrate long into the night, I think. There's always the element of chance in a cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they save up the moment. And this is really special. Getting to celebrate in front of your own fans, Lee. Well, it's giving something back. These fans have travelled all over the place following their team. Now they get to join in the celebrations go into the crowd and give them the cup, that's what I say. Well, then it might never find its way to the trophy cabinet, Lee.